Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell for notification. Hey guys, hey guys, hey guys, hey, 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 Welcome back to another video. So today I have for you another torrid haul. And you might hear some rain pitter-pattering in the background. And that is because it is freezing rain. We had a lot of snow here. I think at least 10 centimeters from what I read on the news. I don't know. It's a lot. And now it's all wet and rainy. So you might hear that in the background. So anyways, um, I have a big... I have a BBJ here. Hi, BBJ. <laughs> and I have a huge box of torrid stuff. So let's get right into it. All right, guys. So I'm going to show you what I got. And then, of course, as usual, I will try things on. All right. So first things first, I did get one pair of shoes this time. I'm building my shoe collection pretty quickly, actually. Shoe for every occasion. <laughs> it's nice to have a choice of shoes, you know, like... I don't know. Usually I don't. I just have one pair of crappy shoes that I just slip on and, and go. But all right, so these are size nine and they're wide width. Aren't they cute? Oh my gosh. They're so cute for the holidays. Let me get this crap out of here. They are very cute and sensible shoes. The important thing here is that Pete's won't have to help you slip those on. Unless of course you're going to wear socks with them. Then you'll need some help from Pete's. So that's the shoes. These are just so cute, and they don't have much of a heel, just a tiny, what would you that call that, like a half inch heel. So these are so cute, and this is like a, like velour kind of thing, kind of material. So I really like this. So I got these shoes here, size nine. Um, I'm not going to tell you the prices because honestly, I had some Torrid cash, and this, I think they were on sale. Like it's never what I paid. Oh, $49.50. I don't think that's what I paid. I think I, I got a deal. Um for everything. I think everything, they had a deal where like if you spend over $200, you get 50% off of $200. So yeah. All right. So this is a 4X sweater here. Oh wow. What a beautiful color. I love when they give you an extra button. Most places do because I always end up losing a button. At least one. Really? You losing a button? Are you sure that's not code four? It pops off shooting across the room or wherever you're at. And then you can't find it. Oh, cool. Oh, wow, that's so nice. Nice red. I really like reds. They're very bright. They're very vibrant. And I love wearing red lipstick as well, so that'll go good. So that's just a nice red sweater. And it does unbutton. So I want to wear it more kind of like a cardigan type thing. Well, I was thinking over one of the dresses I got here, so I'll show you that in a second. So this is a 4X. Since I'll be wearing it as a cardigan, I'm not too concerned of it buttoning up, so that's why I got a 4X. Honestly, I do like that sweater. I think that color works for you as well. What else is in here? Okay. I hate this, this, these tassel things. This is a 5X. I think this is the dress. If it's the dress, I'm not... It didn't look like this online. More of a holiday kind of dress. Oh, wow. It does look nice, but... Just a couple of things. First, I see from your statement in the photo that it did say sequins and that you hate sequins. This tells me you don't read descriptions. You just look at pictures. Secondly, I hope you don't think that you're going to look like that girl in the picture. There's no way in hell that dress is going to be flowing like that on you. Nope. Nada. Not gonna happen. Not even if hell freezes over. These things always break or come off, you know what I mean? So I really hate these things. I thought it was just more like a a gold color. Well, we're going to try it on and see. So that's a 5X in this dress here. It's got no sleeves. First, I've got to say it does look like the color gold, so I don't know what you mean by it looked gold. Could your monitor possibly need a setting adjustment? For those of you watching this reaction, please comment down below and let me know if it looks like gold or doesn't. I got a, a black pair of black sheer um, leggings or tights, sorry, I should say, in size 5 6. I have to really get a black garbage bag out. I <laughs> just throw all the wrappers on the ground. And uh, These are a 5X. These are, wow, some really nice underwear. They had a sale where they were like, um, I think these are just the briefs, but they were like, buy two, get the third one free. I'm really at a loss for words here. Well, not really. I mean, I would never use the words gigantic, humongous two-man tent or really, really fucking big. To do that would be really mean. Let's just say, that's a pretty print, and leave it at that. 
So they're expensive underwear, but they're really nice. So they're really worth it. <laughs> and now that I don't get a period anymore, I don't really have to worry about ruining my underwear if there's any benefit at all, right? <laughs> <sighs> okay, so this is a 5X. This is gorgeous. This is a wrap around kind of like kimono shirt. What do you call the kimono shirt? I don't know. <laughs> I'm learning my terms. So this is, oh wow, I love this color. Da, 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 da. I need to dye my hair black. <laughs> but isn't that nice? Actually, that is very pretty print and the red color does suit you. What I question with these torrid hauls is that you buy everything a size or two, too small. There really is no benefit to it, especially when we can see in your face that the fit is uncomfortable. Of course we all know in the long run you will benefit from it because you have made your feeders happy. That is going to only last so long. 5X shirt. The sleeves here. Three quarter sleeves. They're very big. They have a button here you can you can adjust it, but we'll see how it fits. So I can't wait to try that on. So baby, hold me closer in the back seat of your room. I have that song in my head. Five X as well. Ooh, these are sexy. <laughs> oh, they're silky. Some beautiful tent size underwear here. Oh yeah. They're cheeky underwear. <laughs> and I got a lot of cheeks, so. <laughs> oh yes, yeah, some nice lace up here. It's too bad and it feels so nice if someone's rubbing your bum. But it's just like the holidays are not gonna like really be there's not gonna be any parties or anything because of COVID, so kinda sucks getting all dressed up for nothing, but whatever. I have you guys. <laughs> a bra, I forgot I did. I'm starting to collect bras again because my bras are ugly. Oh yeah, look at this bra. <laughs> That'll fit. Oh yeah, it's gonna lift up everything. This is a 46D. I'm not too sure how it's gonna fit. The cup looks a bit <sighs> Well, we'll see. Wait, I hope it fits around at least. Oh yeah, that should fit around. I'm going to see how it fits. And I'll put it on, but I won't show you because I don't want to get monetized. But I will let you know how it fits. Okay. Always worried about the money, about the monetization. Chantel, sometimes you just have to give your feeders what they want and stop worrying about the YouTube coin. Oh. And I did get something to fill out. A pair of... Um, faux leather, 4X leggings. I think the faux leather will look nice. Really? Faux leather leggings? You know, I know, and anybody with any fashion sense knows that this was not a good purchase. There is no way that those leggings are going to be flattering to your figure. Now if you want to enhance your fupa, and your ass for your feeders then you bought right. If you bought these because you think you'll look good in them, Girl, you need to stop lying to yourself. Really, stop lying to yourself. With that shirt. So just a nice pair of... Here they smell. Full leather leggings. So I'll show you what those look like on me. Here you go, guys, a box for you. Alright, I got some accessories. It looks like I don't remember even what I got. Oh, I got sunglasses. <laughs> I don't have good luck with sunglasses, guys. You know this. Okay. <sighs> yeah, I need to dye my hair again. It's looking dull. I think it's because I use this dry shampoo on it. And it kind of dulls the shine. I need to use that on my wigs. So it got some nice, has some nice detail. And I'm sure some of them will fall out. Mm -hmm. mm. Let me fix my hair with it. <laughs> I shouldn't have used that stuff. Ooh, what do you guys think? I'm supposed to wear them like this. <laughs> like this. They're a bit small for my face. <laughs> Strike a pose. I don't know. They're kind of nice. <laughs> kind of nice. See? I have bad luck with sunglasses. Alright. Oh, I got some <laughs> leaf earrings or um, bow earrings for Christmas. Oh, they're like metal. I thought they would be like bow material. <laughs> Check it out. Aren't they cute? <sighs> yes, it's that time of year again, guys. 
And I did get some, something from Betsy Johnson. I did get these cute Betsy Johnson earrings. I love these earrings. They're so nice. So, all right, let's see. Those two pairs of earrings definitely are going to fit, so those you won't have to worry about returning. Let's see how... I think that's all I got. Oh, I have a pair of underwear too, because the buy two get one free. Oh, these are nice navy blue. Silky material. Ooh. Oh, these are 5X, but they're like, look bigger. They have like lace at the back where your butt cheeks are. Yeah. <laughs> I love having nice underwear. It just makes you feel sexy. I don't know. I have right now a Calvin Klein um, sports bra on. So I'm going to change into the clothes. I'm going to, um, yes, change into the clothes. And put those, I want to put the, the tights on to see what the dress looks like with the tights. Um, so, all right, let's, without further ado, let's get to, let's get to. All right, guys, so this is the dress without the cardigan. I don't think you can really see the shoes, huh? Just give me a sec. These are the shoes. <laughs> They're kind of cute, huh? And here's with the cardigan. Now, the dress is not very form-fitting. Um, which I don't really like. Because then I just look like a, you know, <laughs> just like, it looks like a moo-moo kind of. So, what do you guys think? I don't know if I made... good choice for this outfit but so you're asking us what we think well i like the dress the way it's fitting it could stand to be a little bit bigger so it flows i would ditch the leggings when wearing the dress the sweater is too small it should hang and flow a little better and not look like it went through the washer and somebody mistakenly put it in the dryer so far i would keep the shoes and the dress and send the sweater back for one that's a size larger and i return the leggings in exchange for another pair of earrings Anyway, I really like the cardigan. It's really nice. The sweater. So, maybe if the dress was a little bit more tapered in. Stop doing that. The last thing you need is to buy clothes that are too small, that fit too tight. You do not have the figure for it, no matter how much you think you're hot looking and that every man wants you. When you buy clothes like that and go out in public, do you want people looking at you and thinking, who buys her clothes? They dress her like a hoochie mama. Make it look like I have a little bit of a shape, you know what I mean? Bitch, please! Especially this is the bra, it's very lifting. I'm gonna post a picture on my Instagram of it, so you can go there and see. Um, I don't think I'll get demonetized on Instagram for that, but on YouTube, probably will for showing a bra, so. That's not fair showing the bra just on Instagram. What about the rest of us that don't have access to your Instagram? You're not playing fair Chantel, so you give us no choice to not play fair either. Without further ado, please allow us to share with you all, Madam Chantel. And a few comments from her adoring subscribers. I would like to thank our courageous subscriber that took one for the team, and provided us with the images you just saw. I will not mention them by name. They know who they are, and all we're gonna say is thank you, and we owe you one. Anyway, <laughs> so this is just a mini tour haul. Um, yeah, so I just got a couple outfits and some shoes and things. So um, I'll try on the other outfit though. Stay tuned. I can't take any more of you pretending you're a supermodel. You are no Miranda Kerr. Sam, you are one smart cat, getting out while you can. Alright, I don't even know if I'm wearing this shirt correctly. It like has a button. Yeah, my things are hiked up. Inside here. 
and then it ties. So it's <laughs> it's different. Um, these are the pants. They're making noise. This is the shirt with the pants. What do you guys think? I like the colors, but I would have to say you should send it back. The last thing you need to be wearing is anything that you tie just right under your boobs. You do not have a figure for that and you mentioned shape earlier, you have a shape, it's big, there's no figure, there's no hips or waist. You can't count a big gut, a big ass, and a huge fuku as a figure or even a shape. You need to wake up girl, clothes are not gonna fix that, you know what will fix it, you just won't do anything about it. Um, yeah, so this is the shirt. It's really long at the back. But I love the color. This shirt is actually really nice. <laughs> so, yeah. I really like it. What do you guys think? The sleeves? You give me fever. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, this is just a short little haul, guys. So, I hope you enjoyed. And when I get some more stuff, whenever that will be, I will do a haul. So, I really like this shirt. Never know how much I love you. No! God, please, no! No! <laughs> My cat's looking at me like, please don't sing. If you won't listen to us, please listen to your cats. Anyways, guys, I love you guys. Thank you for watching this video, and let me know what you think of these clothes, honest opinions, and, um, honest but, but respectful. You want truthful opinions, but there's always a caveat must be respectful. So here is a respectful opinion about your torrid haul. I would keep the dress, the shoes, and the accessories. I would return the sweater, and exchange it for one size bigger. I would return the shirt for a different style and size that fits, and I would return the leggings in exchange for additional accessories, or another pair of shoes. You would do much better with your torrid shopping if you just came to the realization that you have no figure, that tight-fitting clothes, do not look good on you no matter what you think. Despite what you and your subs consider as hateful comments, what I just gave you was not hateful in any way, and you know it. It just wasn't flattering. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys. Thank you all for watching our video. If you have any questions, comments, or suggestions please leave them in the comment section below. Don't forget to share this video with someone who you think might find it interesting, and don't forget to subscribe and click the bell to make sure you get notifications of when our next video comes out. Take care, and we will see you all in the next video.